It is time for some more Minecraft bingo. I'm on my own looking at seed 9101 for bingo. And I understand now why the times I've seen posted have been like 20 minutes, 32 minutes, did not finish. <laughs> this is a tough card. The only thing that looks quasi-reliable is the diagonal from the milk bucket to the furnace cart, uh, which requires finding a cow and a bunch of iron. Um, however, the fourth and fifth columns, the fourth column, if we happen to luck into an enchanted book, and the fifth column, if we happen to luck into mushrooms and chickens and a bunch of sugar, um, are also plausible things to fall back on. So I will try to get items in those two columns as well, unless I find the cow and some early iron uh, early on in this card. But this is a very difficult meta. Uh, also, if we happen to see a village with beetroots, that would also change things in that we could go for the top row. Um, but based on the times I've seen, it seems like that's kind of unlikely. Do I see cows anywhere? I don't think so. We do have a boats, boats, boats week. So I could consider sailing at the start. I don't see any like underwater dungeons or anything. Um, there is some sugar cane right here. Alright, so let's grab my boat, and I guess I'll grab the sugar that's right here, and there's more sugar over there, yeah, just in case we end up needing to do the map. I guess we can do that, and I'm also going to go ahead and just grab three sand uh, so that I have them on me. And, hmm. Yeah, this is a tough card to try to manage and reason about. I would really like to attempt to find a cow in the early going. There's a sheep. Not as useful. All right, there would be enough of this here. Let's go ahead. Yeah, let's go ahead and grab a tree, get some tools going, continue to think through this card. Hmm. If I don't find the cow, it would be... If I don't find the cow, none of my three options work, actually. Well, possibly the fourth. Yeah, that's the least reliable of them, though. Gosh darn it. <laughs> yeah, this is a really tough card to think about. Uh, did I just see clay? I did. Let's go ahead and grab that. All right, I have some wood. Do I want to make tools just yet? I think no. I think actually I'm going to continue to sail around a little bit more and see if we can spot a cow. Because without a cow or some other leather animal... I am really struggling to come up with what to do. Okay, I see some chickens, and the feathers would be good, and I also happen to see a red mushroom, which is a little bit of a rare commodity. So we're going to have to grab that, and then we're going to have to be able to kill the chickens. Fortunately, chickens do not have many hit points, which means we can kill them using a tool we were going to make anyway. This guy. Hiya! Hey. Hiya! There we go. And I got my feather. Okay, great. So that is done. And I think since we don't have... <laughs> I should have done this before, but it just occurred to me since I need to pick this back up. It's probably quicker to go... Oh, there was stone right here. Oops. All right. Well, that cost me a little bit of time, but I have a feeling... Oops, what am I doing? <laughs> I have a feeling that small amounts of time are not necessarily going to make or break this card. Of course, now that I said that, I expect my time will be like within one second of someone else's time. Okay, and so do I want to get all the usual tools? Yes. All right, so we'll do all the usual stuff. And actually for right now, uh, let's just make the ax and I'll worry about the shovel later. Let's continue looking briefly. See if we can spot any cows. And I guess now that I have the brown mushroom, the red mushroom would be great to find as well. Or the other way around. You know what I mean. And I think I just saw some coal right here. And that would also be useful to me. Because I'm likely to need to cook a fair number of things regardless. And I see some pigs up there and I don't have any food. And sadly, the seed seems like a seed where I'm going to need food. Many of the bingos are short enough that you don't really need it. This doesn't seem like it's going to be one of those, so let's do that. 
Um, yeah, and while we're up top, let's try to look around in the world. Uh, sheep that way. There's a brown mushrooms everywhere. Not seeing cows anywhere. I'm going to choose to go this way. I'm going to pop by a brown mushroom to shore up that little portion of the card. Uh, okay, we have to peek down for iron. Hold the phone. Uh, can I get some easy iron down here, please? Please and thank you. Not right here, apparently. Any chance there was some right over here? I don't think I'm deep enough over here, so we're still above sea level. And iron spawns below sea level. So that's not going to work. Here's my brown mushroom. Great, got it. Okay, still looking for cows. Yeah, or another leather animal. Without one of those things, none of the columns or diagonals that I was going for can possibly work. That sounds like a zombie dungeon. There is a dungeon of some sort here. It's a spider dungeon. That's kind of good, actually. I didn't get a good look. There was some gold in there. I saw a bucket, which is always nice, uh, because that means I could milk the cow already. That could go on the bar, that could go on the bar. There's a few things here that I can throw away. I got beetroot seeds! Um, how many bones do I have? I have seven bones. Okay, that just changed everything. I need to go find a spruce tree. Okay, beetroot seeds and bones. If I have the spruce tree, how much iron do I need? Uh, I do need some iron. I need five of it, it looks like. Did I see other iron right here? Um, other iron, please. Uh, I, I kind of vaguely thought that I saw some. Yeah, here's some. Okay, that's two, three, four, five. That should be everything. Yeah, if I find a spruce tree, I think I can go win this card. And of course, I never made my, what do you call? Okay, so if I were a spruce tree, I don't remember if there were any anywhere around here. And I just came from that direction. Let's go this way for them. Where did I come from this direction? I'm not sure. I'm deep in the forest and I can't, oh, there's a spruce. Okay, great. So I have my clay I can cook up. So that's the first thing I'm gonna cook up and then I can cook up the sand. Yeah, so let's get near a spruce. That is step one. Step two is to set down the furnace. Uh, step three is to get it cooking uh, some of the things I need, like sand. Okay, so we're looking at the top, top row. And is this tree going to be enough? Not necessarily, and I do need to do a lot of cooking. So we'll chop down a second tree just to make sure. Okay, now I'm definitely going to get a spruce sapling. Uh, then let's set this down. Uh, I am going to need to craft up this, and then I'm going to need to throw this in next. And then I need to get my pumpkin seeds going, or beetroot seeds, whatever they are. Which means I need a tool, which means I need sticks. All right. Um, and I am just low enough on bone meal that I want to make sure that none of these uproot. Do I have any water nearby? I don't. Um, is there anything else that I need? I still need the spruce sapling, I think. So hurry up on that, please. Okay, that must be it. Uh, so let's grab this. Uh, let me update the card because my brain is going kind of nuts. Oh, I still need to cook up the iron too, right. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave the iron in here to cook. I'm gonna go find some water, which is presumably nearby. It's not particularly nearby, gosh darn it. Okay, that's okay. I'm gonna go straight in this direction until we hit water. Unless, that doesn't look like that's going to work. <laughs> Should I just cook up the beet? I'm not sure. If the beetroot's up root, I'm not sure that I have enough bones, but I guess let's risk it. Okay, so beetroot seeds. Uh, and bone meal. I need the beetroot seeds still in the bar, though. Okay. Because beetroots take a lot of bone meal. Yeah, see, that's what can happen if you're not careful. Yeah, I'm not sure that I have enough bone meal. I might get super lucky here. This one is not done. 
I got five and a half, but I have lots more seeds. So if I get a tiny more bit of bone meal, then I should be in good shape. I need a furnace cart, uh, which needs means I need to pick up the furnace, but that's okay because I don't need the furnace for anything else. All right. Furnace. I thought I threw my saddle out. Um... And I have plenty more seeds, so let's imagine that a piece of bone meal or two will do it. And if I happen to come back here, <laughs> could try to find that again. Um, if I were a bone, I could be pretty much anywhere underground. Do I have dirt in my inventory? Let's get uh, another piece of dirt in my inventory. Uh, just to ensure I can't screw that up. And I don't have any good food on the bar, so let's fix that. There we go. Let's go ahead and eat one of these. So I'm going to get some water. And I'm going to go find, find a skeleton to get a bone. Uh, or if I happen to see a fossil in the ocean, that would also be bones. Don't immediately see or hear skeletons there. Uh, seeing a fossil is pretty unlikely. So I probably should hop back down into this cave. And see if there's any skellies down here. Oh, it's not really a cave, is it? Yeah, it kind of is. Uh, not with skeletons, though. Let's also do this. Just have plenty of blocks. I don't know why I closed off that water. <laughs> I could find a skeleton on the surface at this point. It's also possible my beetroot could grow on its own at this point. So should I hang around the beetroot? Can I get back to the beetroot? I kind of vaguely know where it is. Hold on. It's another cave-like thing here where there might be a skeleton already spawned. Nope. And the skeletons who will be here in the frozen biome will be strays, and so there's a chance I will die. Um, so I'm going to see if I can luck back into finding my beetroot. Um, and go skeleton hunting. Could be a cave right here. And I do have some decent food on the bar. I don't have the beetroot tools on the bar properly just now. Oh, and the beetroot's not going to grow at night anyway, is it? Because uh, I don't have a torch. I could make a torch if I found the beetroot seeds again. Uh, let's just focus on killing a skeleton or two. They should be spawning any moment here. Uh, if I were a skeleton, and then if I want to do that, then I want... All right, let's uh, throw out a bunch of stuff I don't need. And let's triple check. Yeah, all I need is beetroot stew. And I never made the mushroom stew bowls. Let's go ahead and make that. Or waiting for skeletons to appear. I'm calling the mushroom stew bowls and their beetroot stew bowls on this card. Um, let's eat this. Hi sheep. Yeah, I know you're scared. I'm scared too. Let's have this on the bar, and then we'll eventually yeah have to put the bone meal on the bar. Okay. Skeletons, where are you? Are you in here by chance? Are there any mobs anywhere in the world? Just need a skeleton so I can grow a beetroot. Got five out of six. Um, while I'm waiting for them to spawn, there's a chance that my beetroot grew while it was still daytime. If I could go find it. Here's a skeleton. And he did not drop a bone. Bummer. Okay, that's a zombie, not a skeleton. Uh, let's see. If I were my beetroot, I don't remember this sheep being around. I just come from this direction, I think, to get into uh, this area. There's a cow, finally. It's a little late for that. I went and changed rows. I feel like I was on the edge of the spruce forest over here somewhere. Maybe it was back over this way. I don't know that I'm going to find my other beetroot. That's okay, we just need a skeleton to drop some bones. Dem bones, dem bones, dem bones. Uh, maybe it's right over here, actually. I seem to recall having seen these guys when I came over here. So yeah, I think my beetroot... I don't know where the beetroot that I planted before was. Yeah, I don't really recognize this. Skeletons, where are you? Well, I had high hopes... And I don't know if I got unlucky. Oh! Hey, look! Doggies are helping me out. Good job, doggies. 
Get them bones. Okay, I'm gonna eat this. I need to get away from the zombie. Go get him, doggy. Okay, and I need to plant. Change up. Hey. Ugh. Too many bad guys. Don't you dare uproot my crops. There we go. Beetroots stew. Okay, that was extremely inelegant, but 1412, I am not unhappy about. Uh, I wish I would have been a little bit more lucky with the bone meal so that I had enough to finish the other thing, and I am curious. I'm just going to fly around in game mode 3 really quick and see if I can spot the other place that I planted my beetroots. I found the other beetroots and they hadn't grown, uh, and so I was going to need the bone meal regardless. All right, I feel better for knowing. So just to finish things off, we got the top row, which was kind of completely unexpected, but it was a weird card. I hope, as always, that you guys are having a great day, and I look forward to comparing scores with all of you. Bye-bye.